Good evening. Joe McCormick is off tonight. A man convicted of shooting at Erie Police will now face at least two decades behind bars. Jackie Roberts was in the courtroom with the sentencing today. Jackie? Sean, the defendant apologized for the situation that could have been deadly to all three men invo involved, telling the judge he's deeply sorry for what he's put the officers through. DeAndre Tate being taken into custody with 25 to 50 years in prison ahead of him. A jury found Tate guilty of assault of a law enforcement officer and attempted homicide. The defendant fired several rounds at two officers in the parking lot of the Soldiers and Sailors home in January of 2017. Deputy Chief John Nolan was working that night. We all know that this is a dangerous job. We knew that when we swore our oath, but we still we have a job to do. And number one is to protect the community, but number two is also to go home to our families at the end of the night. Nolan says the sentence is fair. Prosecuting attorney Paul Sellers agrees. It's an assault not just against another a citizen, but also uh, against an officer who's there to protect and to serve. And that's really an assault against one of the foundations, one of the institutions uh, of our community. The defense attorney calls what happened that night out of character for the defendant, and he says other factors may have contributed to the crime. I, I know how remorseful he is. I know how thankful he is that, that something worse didn't happen. He comes from a good family. It's not the person that I know. Placidi says Tate suffered from mental health issues and had stopped taking his medication prior to the incident. In trial, the defense made the case Tate did not try to shoot at the officers, but rather in the air in an attempted, quote, suicide by cop situation. During that incident, police did return fire, hitting Tate in the side and in the chest. Both attorneys agreeing it was extremely fortunate that this, that this incident was not fatal and that neither officer was injured. Sean. Jackie Roberts reporting tonight.